Hey, my name's Doug. I am the technical support specialist involved with the warranty and service department. Uh, it's my job to take care of your, uh, your trailer post sales. At the moment we're involved in the middle of a recall on Dometic stoves. So the models involved with this recall are going to be your 21 and 22 editions. Um, anything up to May the 5th of 2022 was possibly involved in this recall. Uh, but you will have to check the serial number on your unit just to be sure. So today I want to show you how we check the serial number on our stoves just to make sure that they're not involved in this recall. So what we're going to do first of all is going to show you the pandle. Uh, the tools you need are very very simple. Simple screwdriver with a Phillips 3 head. This is the Dometic stove that's involved, it's the PI8022. It's fastened in on the units with four screws on either corner. So the best way to lift this up, rather than try and put your nails underneath and lift it, is just close the lid, grab the finger hole and give it a pull forward. What you have is your serial numbers. I can tell at a glance this one's not included because uh, it's only up to serial number 800. Unfortunately, you have to lift the stove out to see it. As you can see, the serial number is hidden when it's sitting in the unit. That's how you check them on the pando. Because the riv nut is on the underside of the box, sometimes you've got to fish around when putting the, the screw in. Uh, but usually, uh, if you just drop them in vertically, they will find the riv nut. We've now seen the pando, we're having a look at the expedition now and see how we remove the stove top. It's a different unit, obviously. Instead of the pull out drawer, we have the drop down, uh, the sink and stove combo. Same stove, slightly different fitting. In the pando, we use bare riv nuts on the bottom. On the expedition, we are using an additional fastener and an acorn nut. So what we want to do is we want to use a 7 16 wrench as well as a Phillips 3 head screwdriver. We want to secure the nut on the underside and then release the screw on the top. So once again, it's the exact same stove, it's the exact same fitting. Pull the lid down, give it a little pull. The unit lifts up and there is our serial number on the front. And then putting them back in again. You need to take note though that there's three long ones, one short one. The short one goes in the front right hand side. Put your screw in, you feel it coming through the underside. Then secure your acorn nut on the underside. So hopefully that was helpful. And uh, please refer to any documentation that we supply as to whether your Dometic stove is affected by this recall or not. So if you have any further questions, please feel free to email me at warranty at offgridtrailers.com. Um, again, this is Doug. Speak soon. Bye-bye.